In this video, I will show you how to store time and compare time in PHP and MySQL. The reason is time is a little complicated because we have months, date, year, hour, minute, second. So it's a little difficult. In MySQL, we have date time type. It's the date, data type. In PHP function, we have a date function to store the current date. In for compare to compare time, it's better to convert all the time in the Unix time. In PHP we have MK time function. In the MySQL we have Unix time stamp. So let's look at the one uh, one SQL script here. We create a table members. I define a uh, modified date is a type is the date type. So I can set before is zero 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 this this is zero zero first zero zero is zero zero year. Second one is month. So that one is date, then hours, minutes, seconds. So let's look at the PHP code here. In this code, we mainly submit the months, date, months, date, and year selected by users and post to the form. In here, we have date n. This date n mainly uh, convert the current month in the numbers is one to one to twelve. It's digital number. It's no zero before in front of the uh, one. For example, on no zero one, it's just one. Also date F date F this is the textures text of uh months for example for example it's the May, June, July, it's kind of not the zero five, not the five, six, seven. It's a text text. Another one we use the date J function. Date J function is the date current date. So we have 1 to 31 sections. So in the we also have date y function. This date y show the current year. So I will run this code to see. Run this code. So run so you can see uh, I months May here currently is May, so this is the, is the text text is not the numbers zero one or the one two three four two twelve it's uh, just you see the May June July text. Another one is the date. So date we we have here numbers here one two thirty one another here year. So this is produced by date function here. Or it's simply by data function. So to compare the time, for example, now I already form. Now I post my month, date, and year. I post this one because I did not set the uh, hours, minute, the second, I put this zero. Then I use the MK time to convert to a Unix time. And in my SQL, I have a Unix timestamp. So, for example, I this is the modified date, is the column from the here. In the my SQL table, is type is the date time type. So, I can use the Unix timestamp convert to the unit time. Then I compare to the search date which is produced by the PHP function MK time. So in here I can compare the time. I can like, use the post the time and I can transfer to the unit time and compare them. In summary, in this video I will show you how to store the time and compare the time. Store the time and compare the time. Thanks for watching.